I am in a chair right beside Penny and she is in the bed right beside me. Okay, so here's what's crazy, just insane for me, is that the first time that she had her shunt, I was in the same room at the same hospital. Not the same bed. She was in a crib. But she, that's, I mean, it's just like all those f- memories start flooding back. Right now, they're just basically monitoring her. They think that the shunt is malfunctioning, which totally happens. Almost 50% of all shunts malfunction. They changed the setting on the shunt. It now drains more fluid, which is a good thing with having the uh, programmable shunt. So hopefully by tomorrow, she's going to feel better and no more vomiting, no more fever, no more anything, just penny. She's the reason why we wanted more children. I love her so much. I feel like this kind of video is flooding, flooding my world. channel to be known about all of our hospital stays. I want our channel to be adventures. Oh, by the way, she doesn't want to take off her mask. You can take off your mask. It's almost one, but so much has happened. We have had a CT scan. We had fluid extracted from her brain to take off the pressure, hallelujah. We have also had an ultrasound. Now we are off to put dye inside of her shunt that will basically make sure it's running properly. I was going in to get my drains out and then boom, needing to go to the hospital, so. I don't have anything. I'm gonna go to CVS real quick next door and get what I need. I got Penny, new undergarments, and I got myself some because it's really hard for Joe to both the kids to come down here and then for me to run down and pick up stuff when I can just walk across the street. Because this hospital is about an hour from us. Crap, I think I'm lost. I'm gonna have to continue this in a bit. I came here and I had nothing. I didn't have a change of clothes for Penny. I didn't have a change of clothes for myself. So now everything is set. Um, and I'm rushing back before the doctors come because they're supposed to give her brain scan. So she just finished going, basically they put a dye in her shunt and they're making sure that it's working properly. I wanna get back before doctors come and say, yes, it's working properly. Or no, it's not working properly because that can really be a game changer for our next week. What I'm saying is if it's not working properly, we're looking at a surgery. So hopefully it's working properly. 